Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to cancel level 2 on Webull application. So, first of all, of course, you would like to go and download Webull application on your phone. Of course, if you don't have it on your phone, you would like to go and download it through Play Store if you're using an Android, App Store if you're using an iPhone, or any other store you could be possibly using. Then, you would like actually to go and open the application, then sign up to create your account. Of course, if it's your first time. Uh, you would like to create your account if you already have an account just ignore all of that log into your account and let's just get straight into the tutorial so let me just here go and open my available application as you should of course if you want to follow this tutorial steps so let's just wait until the application loads and as you can see here that will be actually my home or my main screen and here i'll be able to see the old stocks or my watch list stocks and of course, I have a video on how to add like uh, cryptos, stocks, or any other thing in your watch list. If you want, you will find it down below this channel. So let's just go back. And uh, does even we will automatically charge for level two? So we will provide user two tiers of market of market data. All users have access to level one trading data. Uh, that include the highest BIM information level 2 data show, the scope of bid slash ask price for a given security. New users get 3 month comple complimentary access to level 2 data after it costs 1.99 uh, 99 cents per month. It's actually $2. So if you actually finish your 3 month after downloading the application and using it of course, if you want to have the level 2 option, uh, all you need to do is just pay $2 per a month and you will actually be good to go. And about uh, how can you cancel uh, your trade on uh, Webull? Of course, if you have the full options on this application, you will find uh, an icon here. Just go on, uh, at the bottom middle. Of course, you will find an, a fifth icon there. Just go and click on that and after you click on that, you will need to just click on transfers and after clicking on transfers on your Webull page, just go to the stocks and tap at history and locate the transfer request that you would like to cancel. Tap at cancel and you'll be good to go. So that will be actually for the tutorial. I hope you guys like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.